Budgets slash thousands out of work and cities across Michigan are looking for some sort of solution in Jackson. That solution is going to cost people their jobs. Jackson City workers are going to bear the brunt of more than $2 million worth of budget cuts. Fox 47's Maureen Halliday has those details for us tonight. The city of Jackson cutting millions from their budget includes employees. 19 positions will be eliminated to make up for lost revenue from the COVID-19 crisis. Looking at full time and part time positions and it really impacts a lot of different levels of city government. We wanted to make sure that uh, we preserved as much essential service as possible. The position cuts affect several important government offices. The attorney's office and uh, the treasurer's office uh, and uh, quite a bit from Parks and Recreation. Uh, the biggest uh, job reduction that we're seeing is at the Jackson Police Department. We're seeing uh, people like cadets, or uh, school service liaison officers, things like that, uh, who are no longer going to be employed. The city says the cuts will be painful, but will go a long way towards balancing the budget. Looking at that $2.6 million, uh, the staff reductions are a big part of that, uh, well over a million dollars. And that is people's salaries, but it also accounts for benefits and uh, the cost of having them as employees. Programs and special projects have also been cut. We decided to cancel our entire summer recreation programs and close our public pool. So that is a big cost saving there. Uh, some of those things are kind of on hold in a uh, wait and see period right now to make sure that uh, we're being financially responsible and a little bit cautious as we emerge from COVID. Jackson's new budget will take place on July 1st, the start of the new fiscal year. Reporting in Jackson for Fox 47 News, I'm Maureen Halliday. The $2 million budget cut is four times the amount the city spends on street lighting.